All right, today in this 2013 Ford F-350 Super Duty Crew Cab, we're gonna show you part number WT120030. This is the WeatherTech mud flaps for the rear tire and wheels. We have them installed in a driver's side of our truck, and we'll go ahead and see how they look. We'll start from the top, and you see how it matches up to the contour of the factory friend wheel, all the way around and down, and even past the bottom, probably by about four inches, and that provides coverage for the inside tire as well. And from the bottom of the fender well, down to the bottom will be about nine and three quarter inches. Now there's no drilling involved, and it comes with all the hard work to install it. All the attachment points that are facing towards the tire are stainless steel hardware. They're very flexible, but definitely hold their shape. Next, we'll go ahead and show you how they install. They're very easy. Looking underneath the truck, facing out, we can see the fastenings we have to remove. There are one, two, three, four plastic rivets that have to be removed and one small screw. On the plastic rivets, there's typically a small edge where you can take a flat screwdriver and work it inside and open up the center of the rivet. Once you have it loosened up, you can pull out the center more and then the whole rivet. If you have a trim panel tool, this actually works really good to pull the rivets out as well. Now let's go ahead and remove this little screw right here. Now to remove that screw, we used a 5.5 millimeter socket. All right, next we need to go ahead and install our hardware for these holes right here. You see this piece of hardware right here? They get replacements to cover up the holes that were used by plastic ribbons. So we want the flat side facing out. It's nice and centered, and we'll just go ahead and install the rest of them. Sure. All right, we'll go ahead and put this liner, let it fall back into place, and we'll stack our new mud flap on top of it and install new hardware. Our new hardware will be a new stainless steel screw and a flat fender washer. We'll just get them all started and then we'll tighten them down for good. We have all the hardware loosely installed, we'll go ahead and tighten it down. Now we'll need a different size socket. We're going to use a simple quarter inch socket. When we tighten these down, we don't have to crush them, just run them down until they naturally want to stop. That'll do it for part number WT120030. WeatherTech mud flaps on our 2013 Ford F350 Super Duty Crew Cab.